guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, a big welcome and don't forget to subscribe. Today, I'll be showing you how to make your own stickers. So first, you'll need some images you like. I have some black and white ones and colored ones. I got these off the internet. So you'll want to print these out. These I printed from a laser printer, but a color or inkjet should also work. You'll also need some tape. I am using packaging tape, but you can also use scotch tape. You'll also need a bowl and some water. This is just tap water I put in a bottle. Next thing you'll need are scissors and wax paper. Parchment paper works too, if you don't have wax paper. To begin, take your printouts and cover the images in tape. So the first one I'll do is this no problema one. So you want to cover each one with tape. If your image is bigger than the tape, you can use two pieces of tape. Just make sure you overlap them. So I'm just gonna finish taping the rest. See how my lemon matched my lemon drink and the strawberry matched the strawberry drink? Cute, huh? So I am done taping. So you can decide if you want your stickers to have a border or not. Depends on how closely you cut them. For mine, I am leaving a bit of a border on them. Okay, these small scissors are a bit too small and not as sharp, so I'm upgrading to these. Much better. Again, I'm cutting a bit of a border on my donut. Time for the strawberry. This was actually a background image for your phone screen. It had a ton of strawberries on it. That's why it's a bit blurry. I used Google Docs. It had a really good cropping tool. So I'm just going to cut the rest of my stickers. What do you think of my cutting skills? Don't you think I have good cutting skills? So I am finally done cutting them out. I have this yellow smoothie drink, this strawberry smoothie, this strawberry, this no problema, this chubby donut with sprinkles, this cactus that says free hugs, but no one wants to hug it, and this one that says, big things often have small beginnings, and it's a quote. So next, you'll need your bowl and water. Pour some water in your bowl. So what I am going to do is put the stickers in the water. You want to make sure all your stickers are fully in the water. And you want to let them sit for about five to 10 minutes for them to become stickers. The process is super duper easy. It's okay if they touch. It doesn't matter that much. While you're waiting for these, you want to prepare your wax paper. You want to have enough for the stickers to have enough room. So after about 10 minutes, take one of your stickers and flip it over and basically try to rub off the paper. It's easier to do it in the water. Make sure you rub all the paper out. Once you remove all the paper, take the sticker and place the sticky part on the wax paper. Use a napkin to blot extra water. So I'm going to do the rest and rub the paper off the rest of the stickers. The watermelon looks pretty cute. You know you could let these sit overnight and the paper will come off super easy if you want it. The donut is so cute. Here's the side review so you can see how the paper is rubbed off. So these are all the ones I did. So you can let these dry for about 10 to 15 minutes. So these are dry and I want to stick some on my binder. The color is pretty, but it's simple, so these stickers will help. You basically want to peel off the stickers. They're pretty sticky. So I will put one here, and then I'll put the free hugs here. The last one I'll stick on the binder is a donut. Doesn't my binder look better? I also have this little pouch I made and want to put this quote on it. There, so cute. Also, I want to show you my water bottle I decorated. I love these watercolor flowers and decided to turn them into stickers. I think they look great on my plain water bottle. So I still have these food color stickers. I'm not sure where I should put them. Since I'm not sure yet, I'll just save them in my sticker book in the meantime. 
And that's it for this video. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite stickers are. Thanks for watching Pink Pinkney, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!